Hey guys, thank you for coming back to my channel. I really appreciate it. Hope you all are doing well this evening. Guys, you would not believe I have been trying to film this at least two times. I'm so over it. But anyway, guys, why I have been trying to get to my Dollar Tree and my area for the last three or four weeks and I finally made up my mind I was going to get ready and go around there and see what they have because I have been seeing on some YouTuber channel some nice things that I want to pick up for fall because I want to do my kitchen and my living room and put some stuff in my bathroom for fall because that's one of my favorite seasons is fall, spring and fall. So guys, I was going to go around there because usually I haven't been to my local Dollar Tree to be honest with you. It's been at least two years. And because me and my sister and my mom, we usually go to the Dollar Tree that's, um, I'm trying to see, the Dollar Tree that's like 35, 45 minutes away from us. It's a bigger store. It's two of them, actually. It's a bigger store. They're always fully stocked, and we really enjoy going to those. So anyway, I was going to go and just check out and see what mine's had because it's like, 20, it's, it's like 15, 20 minutes away from me. Guys, do you know last week I found out that um my local dollar tree one of the workers and one of the managers got shot thank god they survived and one of the young men was a college um uh, young man he was he's working and he's in, in college i don't know what happened i don't know if it was a robbery they trying to break up something i don't know what it was but they got shot thank god they survived and they didn't die or anything but and they're okay but guys, my nerves is shook. You understand me? And this can happen anywhere. It doesn't matter where you at. Everywhere is starting to get bad. I'm in the suburbs. Even though it does not matter, I'm just saying. The suburbs is not like it used to be anymore. It has changed. And it's just getting bad everywhere. It's just so crazy and ridiculous. But anyway, I'm praying that God calms my nerves down. And I will be okay because it's just... It's just heartbreaking and it is very disturbing to me. So, I don't know, but me and my sister and my mom, I'm just going to wait until they go to the one that we always go to that's 35, 45 minutes away from me. And then I can see what they have and I can also film for you guys. But anyway, guys, I just wanted to let you guys know about that. Again, I hope you all are well. And I'm going to jump right into this Walmart um, haul for you all. The first haul is just a lot of cleaning supplies and um paper products and fresheners so let's go guys right here i replaced my hauls because i always get the economy pack i think this is a really good deal because um i like to keep these around every time my throat start acting up because where i'm at the weather is hot during the day then at night it gets really cold and we about to go into the fall and winter so i love to keep these on hand it's like two dollars and some three dollars and some it's a really good price and these these are the only ones that i prefer that i've been getting for years also if you have any problems with your throat not only nice warm tea helps but guys cut open a lemon put one of these down in there with some honey and suck on it you would feel much better that's what my mom used to do for me and my siblings when we had a sore throat so like I said, this is just a replacement pack. Um, right here, this is just some Clorox um, cleaning gel for the toilet. I like to keep my um, bathroom toilet clean, my whole bathroom smelling nice and good. So I got that. Over here, y'all know this is my favorite detergent, my Dawn. This is the pomegranate and the rose water. I was all out of the ones that I bought about two, three months ago. So I decided to just replace it and get two. When I go back again, I get two more. Over here, this is um, my Clorox cleanser. This is one of the cleanser, cleaner that I like right here. Smells so good, guys. Tahitian grapefruit splash. Guys, it has my whole kitchen and bathroom smelling so good every time I use it. I love it. Should have got two. I don't know what I was thinking. When I'm in the stores, I try to film as I go at, you know, of course. But I try to hurry up and get out the store, too. So, back here, I've been getting this for years. This is, um, I love all of the lifestyle products this is the brand new day this is the um, all-purpose cleanser and i like this um, brand because i like the scent and all of the lifestyle cleans very well but i just really like this particular scent it smells so good too when i clean it clean up my kitchen with it or either my bathroom it just smells so good 
but be careful guys i made a mistake one day and it's another one that's out there it's lysol but it's the foam bathroom foam guys i hate it first of all the nozzle is different it's splash everywhere every time you use it and it don't clean as good i don't think it's clean as good so just be careful because it's one out there just like that just like this one it is lysol product but it's the bathroom phone i hate it i don't like it but i'm not going to throw it out that's the only one i made a mistake and picked up i'm just gonna finish using it and hopefully when i'm finished with this one i will take this spray nozzle off and put it on there but like i said i don't think it cleans as well always look for the one if you're interested in an all-purpose cleanser so that's what I got over there. Over here, guys, I got some more. Y'all know I love my Moonlight Game, Moonlight Breeze. I like the fireworks, and I like the fabric softener and the detergent. So I went ahead and picked up another one of these until I can get to BJ's sales, the real huge one. Y'all know I told you before, I wash every two weeks. That's twice a month. I wash everything in my apartment. Gets washed. Everything. So I'm all out. So I got this one to tie me over. It's the next time I wash and time to get to BJ's and get the real huge ones. Over here is just some um some hand soaps that I like. I like the scents. I like how it smells. I like how it makes my hand feel real nice and soft and moisturizing. So I got the soft soap back here. This is the newer one been out for about six months. This is the lavender and shea. I really love the scent and how it makes my hands feel. I like this dial one. Both of them is dial. This is the marula oil been out for for a while for years it smells so good and i also is crazy about the white tea one i wish that bottle i wish um i could get the big bottle for the maroon or oil but they didn't have it so i just took those over here guys you already know that i love my febreze products but it's only two that i really like it's a really good scent you can smell it and your house smells so good and fresh and it just fresh and clean and, it, and it's like a paradise just like it says the Unstoppable Febreze Paradise. I love this one. I wish it came in a candle. I've been searching. Can't find any candles. But I can't wait to get my hands on the plug-ins and also the small spaces. But no candles as of yet. But I got two of these because I love them. A little goes a long way. Just spray in each room. Just one little spritz. And I'm telling you, it just it smells so good. I like it. And I also like the one that says Spring and Renewal. Those are the only two that I love from Febreze. The other ones to me is too strong for me. Over here, I got a pack of um, Bonnie paper towels. I got these because I didn't want to run through my bigger packs that I have in my prep closet, my bigger packs that I have from Sounds Club. I got a few of those. I don't want to run through them, so I just got this pack right here for now. <sighs> guys, look at this right here, guys. I showed this to you when I did my walkthrough for... Um, the camping section, every time I go to Walmart, I always make it a point to go to the camping section before I leave the store to show you guys what they have. And plus, I like to look to see what they have and see what I want to get. Guys, I never, never seen this in a camping section before. And guess what? It was only one left. This is the outdoor flammable solar um, light adjustable base strap for camping adventures and whatever else but it says lightweight waterproof durable ultra bright light it's a led's lights no batteries needed just the sun guys how cool is this i thought this was really nice and i was kind of disappointed because i wanted to get two but this was the last one left i have never seen this in the camping session it was the last one hanging on the thing and i just grabbed it but i hope i see another one so i can get it but yeah i thought that was pretty neat you know, I'm always looking for something for my preps and and anything to do with light and heat and stuff to cook with. I, I'm just looking for stuff like this. So I thought it was very interesting. I think it was like $3 and some or $5 and something, but it wasn't that much. So I just wish they had another one. So I just picked up that last one. Over here, I got the Stay Free. And guys, this is the 48 um, count. I was looking for the real big one, the 66 count that I usually get when I place my order online. But guys, since I was in the store, I said, let me just go ahead and pick up and replumbish what I already use and, you know, top off a little bit. And whatever I used the last two months, I just want to replace. 
guys it was only one big pack that said 66 and why it was open i was very disappointed i don't know why people go into stores and open things it was just one on the shelf so i just went ahead and got this one this was the 66 count and i guess next month i will try to order the one but no this is not the 66 count the 66 count is the one i wanted to pick up but it was one on the shelf and it was open so i just left it there this is a 48 count so i just grabbed this for now and next month i will order the huge pack the jumbo pack I try to order from online or check the store again. And over here, I just got the Cleanest. This is a smoothing lotion. I like this one. This is the coconut oil and aloe. I like this one. Um, I want to say about two, three months ago, I got one from Sam's Club. They had this, but they haven't had this in in the last two months. Oh, I would have got some more when I placed my Sam's Club um, order, but they haven't had any more. And I really like this one. So I found this four pack of cubes and I just got this one right here, guys. I like to keep my Kleenex around. If I have the sniffles, have to clean my nose, anything, I love, love this to keep Kleenex around. And I really like this one. So I just picked up a pack of those. And that's it from over there. And let's go over to my kitchen counter. Over here, guys, I got this is my Caress 3D um, Octa Fresh. I just got the three pack guys i don't know why the big box stores like bj sam's club and costco's don't sell this crest 3d one in the aqua fresh but i've been looking for it because i wanted a huge pack but i just got this three pack that's one of my favorite um toothpaste so i just picked up a pack of those also my favorite one of my favorite mouthwash i grew up off of this mouthwash i will always get this one long as they have it the crest um scope outlast this big thing was only like three dollars and some change i should have picked up two also guys i got some razors down here i really like this brand i have used it in the past and it's really good just haven't used it in a while but it's really good and i was surprised to see them um have this spy blade in this particular style because usually i see this particular style of razors only by venus so i didn't even know that big made this one so anyway i just picked up a pack of those right there and hopefully if I see a bigger pack, I'll get one because it's only two in there. But that's okay because I still have some more I have to get through. So I just picked up a pack of those. Guys, right here, Swab. This is a limited edition. Guys, I love Swab body wash. I remember when I was a teen and in my early 20s, didn't have a whole lot of money. But listen, Swab always been a good brand. They have good body washes, reasonable price. It lathers up really well and it washes real well and I feel fresh and clean. The only ones that I really like is the Pee Wee. I like that newer one. It's a limited edition. I think I got two of them in my um, stockpile. I think it's called Paradise or Paris or something. But I tried this one right here. I smelt it and guys, it smells so good. I think it's the, it's the Citrus and Jasmine. Guys, this smells so good. Usually, I wouldn't have never thought about smelling this, but... I went ahead and um, smelt it just to see if I would like it, and I do. And plus, like I said, it's a limited edition, and this is a huge bottle too. It's a 48, I mean, 28 fluent ounces. So can't wait to use that. But yeah, guys, can't afford all the name brand. Well, this is a consider a name brand, just a lower end. If you can't afford some of your more expensive ones, you like to use your body wash, guys. I'm telling you. Suave is a good brand. Also, St. Ives is a good brand as well. So, just letting you know that. Guys, right here, you know I've been talking about this ever since I made my channel. This is going to be always in rotation with me. I'm going to always have this in my stockpile. This is the only Nivea lotion I have been using for years since it came out. The Nivea Soft. Guys, I use it all year round. It's lightweight, but it's really creamy and it's moisturizing. A little goes her long ways. And this is the perfect weather coming up for fall and winter. I will always use this. And y'all know every time I do go to the store and I see it, I try to pick up at least one. I love this Nivea Soft. They also have it in the trials. Well, the hand, the hand cream one too that I like to keep in my purse. Over here, I got my... um daily face face cleanser i love this face cleanser this is one of the ones because i use two it's two is no it's one it's two other ones that i use the olay and another one no olay and neutrogena and this one i 
rotate from this one, the Olay Sensitive Skin one, and the Neutrogena. This is the one I rotate with. So I picked up another one of those. They changed the bottle. So also I picked up some more um, shaving cream because I used two already. So I just picked up one. Next time I go, I pick up one more. Guys, I want to show you this right here. I have been looking for this for the last two or three months in my store, Walmart, and I could never find it because they didn't really have it or either they have one on the shelf and it's damaged. I've been looking for the Johnson & Johnson. Um, this is a new one, the almond oil and also the shea in coconut butter oil. Guys, I like to use this. Um, when I get out the shower, I like to use this and then put on my lotion. A little goes a long ways. Guys, not only I feel fresh and clean, this is so softening, softening to the skin. I feel like a baby, and I sleep like a baby. I love this, but like I said, I like to shower first, put a little bit of this on my arms, my legs, elbows, knees, and around my neck and stuff. Guys, trust me, I feel like a baby. And I sleep like a baby. I really like it. And like I said, a little goes a long way. So I am set for a while. So right now I'm still going through my oil that I got um, a couple of months back. It's the, I think it's the Palmer's oil. It's very lightweight. And then I have the Neutrogena one that's very lightweight. So guys, yes, I'm telling you. And it's perfect for this type of weather for fall and winter as well over here guys i found out about this this is the um well first of all i have this is the ogx body wash i just found out they made body wash because um i want to say about a year ago i used to basically keep up on all the new body washes the lotions conditioners you know, everything but I haven't been able to get into the store like I want to because since this whole C19 thing, I just try not to go into the store as much. And if I do, I like to go in the morning where it's not crowded and I like to be in and out. So I found out last year or the year before last that they sell body wash. So I follow this young lady. Her name is, well, her channel is Living, Lib, Living Ash, Living Ash. Such a sweet young lady. I really love her channel. She goes into the stores and check for all the new stuff that they have. And I appreciate her for that. And guys, I found out about this on her channel. When I tell you, I'm not really a um, coffee person. Um, but when I smell this, this smells so good. I cannot wait to use it. And I also found out they have a lotion. Try to look for the lotion online and in the store. I have not had any success yet. But when I do, I will let you guys know. But think about trying this and picking it up. This is the Smoothing Coconut Coffee Scrub Wash. And usually I don't get a scrub wash. But the way she talks about it and how it smells and how it feels, it just makes me want to try it. So I just finally picked it up. And it smells amazing. So I can't wait to use that. Also back here, guys. Um, well, let's start right here. Y'all know that I always pick this up because I already didn't use two. And I'm, I'm just replacing one for now. When I go back next month, I get another one. But I only use, I only can use the Summer's Eve Fragrance Free. Because if I use any of the other ones, I will be in the emergency room. And I'm trying to stay away from the hospital unless it is a life and death situation. But this is the only one I can use. And I'm very happy with it. And my OB doctor was saying this is a good choice as well a little goes a long ways and i also like um honey pot um their shop you know body stuff for your private intimate parts as well over here i never well i always seen hope you guys can see i always seen this body wash brand the name and the brand in the store at walmart but I never picked it up before, but I have seen it on another one of my favorite YouTubers channel. I can't think of her name right now, and I can kick myself, 
I don't like the butcher of people channel, you know, their channel names. But if I can remember it, I will probably put it down in the comment section. But it's another one of my favorite YouTubers. She said her and her daughters love this body wash. They have different ones. But I decided to try this one because this is supposed to be one of the newer, newer ones. And I pick up the coconut milk and vitamin E. Looks so good and creamy. Smells well. Smells good as well. Can't wait to use that. And I will let you guys know how I like it when I do use either one of these because they're both new to me. I will let you know how I like it and how my body react to them. But they have different ones. And this is the one that I choose. I really wish I can think of her name. It's either marriage and mom. No. It's either motherhood and marriage or marriage and motherhood. Very nice lady. I, I follow her hauls. And she also have another ch uh, channel as well. But I can't think of that one. But... Like I said, if I'm messing it up, I do apologize if she's watching or anybody that follow her is watching. It's either marriage and motherhood or motherhood and marriage. She the one was saying how good this is, her and her girls like it. So I'm going to give this one a try. And when I go back, it's another one I want to try because they have different ones. So anyway, guys, over here I have my tree hood. This is one of my favorite ones. Been getting this ever since I found out about it about six to eight months ago so every time i see it i try to get it this is the vitamin c one love it smells amazing my skin to me is glowing after i use it love it over here this is something new that i'm trying well i'm gonna try this is the orx olive oil i'm used i have used their products in the past but since i've been natural i have never used it since i've been natural but i have heard a lot of people talking about this for the last few months how good this deep conditioner treatment is for natural especially for my um hair type i have 4c hair if you know anything about that it's thick and it's long so i'm gonna i'm um i'm excited and just a little nervous only because i gotta be careful because i don't want my scalp to break out so i'm excited because it has the rice water in there. So I have used rice water before, didn't have a problem. And ORX is a pretty good brand. So I'm hoping everything will be okay with it. I'll let you guys know if you're interested how I like it. Over here, Dr. Teal's, guys. Guess what? I picked up this Dr. Teal's. This is the pure Expan sauce soaking. I used to always get the regular Expan sauce from my mom used to use it when i was a child and it, it works wonders for aches and pains but i saw this one right here on another one of my favorite youtube channels because i haven't paid attention to dr tills in a while and guys um this is the one she picked up it was the coconut oil it said epmis xmas sauce ekmet salt and coconut oil Erase aches and soreness from muscle aches, moisturizing, and softened skin. Haven't had a problem with coconut oil, so that's why I decided to try it. They have many different ones and also a few other new ones. I plan on getting at least two more different ones whenever I go back. But I was really excited to get this one. And guess what, guys? I can kick myself again. I had the body wash in my hands and in my cart. I got to the register and started letting her ring up everything. And I just, I put it back because I was just asking a few people in line in the um, cashier, have you ever used this? They said, no, they said they have used the admin sauce before, but not the um, body wash. So I don't know. I put it back, but I kicked myself because I wish I didn't put it back. But I guarantee you, if they have it, when I go back to Walmart, I'm going to get the body wash as well because i'm pretty sure it would be fine because they do have a body wash in a bubble bath one but i want the body wash i might get the body wash in the bubble bath guys i am a huge personal hygiene uh, fan like personal items the lotions deodorant um i'm really big on self-care and all that and soaking and just enjoying your shower and keeping up and keeping yourself fresh and clean is just for the last year and a half i'm not able to keep up with as much because like i said i try not to go in the store as much and it's just been a lot going on but i'm glad that i have youtubers out there that show us what's in the stores what's new and i can just go right to it and pick it up if they have it but yeah my other favorite youtuber she was she picked up this and said how good it is her name 
and let me think because I'm gonna start writing these these channel names down guys I just forgot she's been on YouTube for a while because I follow her on Instagram and on her YouTube channel I believe is pretty nifty love her such a sweetheart such a sweetheart pretty nifty so I hope I pronounce her channel right but yeah she picked up this one as well so I'm can't wait to try it and last but not least guys when I tell you I am super excited do you see it back there do you see it I've been looking for this dove exfoliation body polish the brown sugar and coconut butter honey when I tell you this stuff is flying off the shelves because for the last month and a half I have been looking for this online and in the store and had no luck until when I went to Walmart last weekend guys it was four on the shelves and yes I grabbed two and left two it smells so amazing I have heard nothing but good things about it and I cannot wait to try it I cannot wait I think I'm gonna pepper myself over the weekend I cannot wait to try it so I got two and when I go back, if I see it again, I may pick up one more. Guys, I love about good body polish. I love the tree hood, exfoliation, all that. So I am super excited. I just wish I would have picked up that Pure Ekman Salt body wash. So, but anyway, guys, this is the end of my haul. I'm sorry that it was pretty long. At least I think it was long. But I just wanted to share you. You know, a lot of you guys wanted me to, um, even though you see me put it in a car, you still like a haul. And I like doing it for you guys. It's just, I'm sorry I took so long. Just a lot of stuff been going on and juggling a lot of things. So I hope you enjoyed this haul, guys. Let me know. Do you decide, are you going to try anything? Have you tried anything you see here? How do you like it if you tried it? Do you think you're going to pick one of these items up? You know. So, that's all that I have for now. I will see you guys in the next video. And take care. Have a good night, evening, morning, whenever you're watching this. And I will talk to you guys later. Take care. And I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Also, share. Share, share, share. Okay? Talk to you later. Bye-bye.